What is up, guys? It is Uncle Bob. Welcome back to the channel, or welcome if it's your first time. Thanks for hanging out with me. We are here for some Chrono Trigger. Here to probably finish up this um, this uh, second third of the game here. So, um, yeah, man, only 13 hours in. We should, we'll definitely finish this game by like around 20 hours, probably less. It's a very short game. But, oh man, is it so delectable. Let's just light it up a little bit. <coughs> Woo! That was a good one. Tripped up by allergy senses and everything. Oh, so how's everyone doing today? Hope everyone's doing all right. Oh, let's play some of these old, old glorious games. All right. We feel good. All right, now we got dual golem twins. Now, I'm not going to lie, I kind of forget. Wow, okay, that's how we're going to be doing things. Wow, and just like that, dead. Okay, so what's going to be the secret to these assholes? I kind of forget what you're supposed to do with these guys. Um, Do I want... Let's add Robo in here a quick second. Come, Golem Twins. So these iron orbs are basically used to just win condition. Wow, man. Okay. Oh, we got little squirrely whirlies going underneath my car real quick. Adorable. Seems like this fast magic spell has stopped them from doing their super bullshit move. Chrono might be able to handle this whole fight himself. Do just might. Do just might. Use one of these full ethers as well. 
Yeah, and the counter rate is helping a whole lot right now. I'm probably going to die here, but I'm not honestly caring too much because uh, I'm probably going to do this again just slightly better because I'm going to uh, I'm going to do it with the um, the accessory piece that gives you um, oh, and we die. Okay. All right, now let's use the thing that halves our... Do the thing that halves our MP usage. Rage Band is nice. But that's going to make that easier. Damn, he's got more speed right now. And now it's really just about hitting off this first luminaire. Oh my goodness. All right, let's see how this heals me. And now I think I got these guys in a death loop. Not death loop, that's the wrong term. Come on. I gotta sneeze, I gotta sneeze. <coughs> I need you to not be so fucking fast with that. Damn, not the one that needs it. Fuck, Robo's down. Cure yourself, cure yourself, cure yourself.
Okay, that's already not a good start. That's not a good start. Come on, I want all party members alive for this bullshit. Fuck, man. Yeah, finally. Couldn't keep Robo fucking live, assholes. <laughs> no, Robo. All right, this calls for a golem boss. Dalton displays that cowardice. Just didn't work. I wonder if we could have followed him off. And here we are. Bring it out. Oh, so the contact with the machine is what automatically made it the Moss Immune. That's cool. Lavos mad. And here we are for what is the hardest Lavos fight in the game. Um, yeah, I, I've never done it, but um, apparently those who have, you know, new game plus the shit out of this game and, you know, just beat it and beat it and beat it and grind it until they were, you know, max everything. Um, this is apparently the hardest uh, Lavos fight in the game. At no point in the game, in any of the times you can decide to encounter him before this, which you can, um, none of the times there or any of the times after will Lavos be as strong as he is in this fight. This fight, like, you are literally meant narratively to lose. It's possible to win, but you either got to, like, grind to a level that's, like, just not necessary ever, especially for a game like this, or New Game Plus it, which I've never actually done. I don't know. I just don't like when games, like, give you that little of challenge. Yeah. 
Yep, that's it. That's all it takes. Oh, what a surprise. Oh, no, I never would have known. And there's his mama. You know, he doesn't tell them who he is, does he? There you go. Break it off. Even though you can't really tell it's a scythe. That would narratively be a great way to beat Lavos is her just being like, you can't beat Lavos. Gets summoned and you just whomp them right in front of her. You, know, you can't stop Shala from going. I wonder what happens if it does go in. I'm not about to find out. This is where we get fucked up. Did Lavos move? Like the sp like the whole sprite for him? I was like not super paying attention. Because I've seen this like fucking 30 times in my life. Man's got his soul taken away. Shava's going to get all of you out. And he still couldn't save his sister. Salutes to Shala. Lavos comes out prematurely. It's fucked. This is definitely a way to start off Act 3 of the fucking game.
got fucked. Melchior tried to save Janice, but he was also dragged in. Mishala, unfortunately, she is no longer here. Marley's taking it real hard. Well, that's the thing. We don't need that much time at all. And Isla's coming with because we're going to get robbed. And there's no better thing to have after being robbed than someone... No! Chrono has the fucking... Well, I guess that's what we get for fucking making a deal with the devil for that. Give you the silver earring, your HP's a little low anyway. It's not like fucking Robo needs it, motherfucker. That's fine. A few enlightened did survive. Enlightened ones did survive. But no distinction remains between the enlightened and earthbound. Yeah, can they even use magic anymore? A moonstone left in a sunless spot for a mo for millennia becomes a sunstone. We'll steal that later. Bye. You don't need that. I don't need that. She don't need that. Nope. Nope. Yeah. Let's give that shit to fucking Robo. Because god damn dude did you need it. What's your magic at? Oh god. Isla's would have been fucking worse. Holy shit. Oh, wait, no, that doesn't handle magic defense. Fuck it. You have heals. Did I talk to you? Check back with him because his wares vary from time to time. Oh, really? Carpe diem, baby. I believe I said the same thing the last time I played this game. I'm not going to lie. We grew too dependent. Yeah, yeah on Lavo specifically. The sea of clouds has parted and the blizzard is finally abated. Did them using magic the way they were, did them having the sunstone, like, bring the clouds in here? He must have cried himself to sleep, bruh. Oh, 
Oh, and here's the goofy boy. And of course, he's got hostages now. The old crone and the pesky gurus are gone. I now rename Zeal the Kingdom of Dalton. Bruh. Damn, she just blocked that shit away. I don't know why they turned around. Now to get back all our shit. Now, obviously, without Isla, you just, you know, wander around and find your stuff. My weapons are powerless. They throw me in a room with a fucking ladder. Oh, shit. Yep, we are aboard the Blackbird. Side of our room. Now we're going to attempt to not fight anybody because that's like part of the fun here. Ooh, it's actually about time for me to go. This will have to be a thing for next time, unfortunately. It's a shame those Gollum twins took for fucking ever, because I could not really, uh... Couldn't really figure out... A workable strat with my original party there. Oh, that was hard. That was hard, and that was annoying, and that was brutal. And Chrono is gone, and we got to get old boy back. So next time, we're going to work to get old boy back. So, uh, yeah, until next time, guys. Peace.